A Greene County jury unable to reach a unanimous verdict tonight in a quadruple murder case from 2014. And now the judge is telling them to come back tomorrow and keep trying. Scott Goodwin Bay stood trial this week in the deaths of Trevor Fantroy, Danielle Keyes, Louis Green, and Christopher Freeman. The jurors deliberated for nearly six hours today before calling it off. Color 10's Parker Paget has been in the courtroom for much of the three-day trial. He's live sharing today's developments. Yeah, the day began with Scott Goodwin Bay telling the judge that he would not testify, and then closing arguments ensued, and then the jury started their deliberations at 11. Closing arguments started with Chief Assistant Prosecutor Joshua Harrell highlighting the state's evidence, which includes ballistic evidence connecting Goodwin Bay with the possible murder weapon, and an eyewitness who says Goodwin Bay opened fire on the victims in a room at the Economy Inn on North Glenstone Avenue. Goodwin Bay's defense attorney Chris Hatley cast doubt on the eyewitness, telling the jury that another man may be the actual killer. The state painted Goodwin Bay as a paranoid drug addict who thought the victims were informing police about his activity, but the defense argued the state doesn't have solid physical evidence like fingerprints or DNA that ties Goodwin Bay to the crime scene. Now the jury will be back tomorrow morning at 8.30 to continue those deliberations and we will have a crew here at the courthouse throughout the day and bring you updates as we learn them. Reporting live in Springfield, Parker Padgett, Color 10 News.